Some people make themselves feel good by going to church and doing all kinds of really good things. I, I think that's I think that's great. Um, they sing songs about Jesus and feel really good about themselves. Some of those people are really good people. <laughs> they do so much good stuff, but I, I'll tell you right now, those guys don't bother me much. I'll tell you what makes me sick. <coughs> those guys that that do simple things like gather together and, and honor Him. I don't think they understand the Lord's Supper. I'm, I'm pretty sure it was just a ritual intended for His disciples and didn't have anything to do with order of service. I mean, all it is now is snack time! And what's grape juice and crackers got to do with anything? An act of worship? Sure, just like just like the sing-along session. We all know people who go to church and don't actually believe in the purpose of His Supper. Good Friday? Uh, you mean the Friday before Easter? I like to think of it as a celebration. A party. Ah, that was a good day. <laughs> the day Jesus died. It's actually kind of dark. I mean, the guy died, and from my vantage point, that's pretty much a victory for me. I mean, come on. I love the cross. It's such a great symbol of evil. I even wear one. I even wear, I sing about it. I use it as a good luck charm. Robin, you know. Evil. 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 Remember his death. You know that was a good day. I'm telling you, there's nothing like death in the morning. Let me, oh my goodness, this is the greatest sound in the world when someone's dying on a cross. Was that scary enough?